YouTube, how is it going? Got a new haircut. Hey, for the girls. You right? Um, today I'm going to be doing bass fishing tips and how... Oh, just bass fishing tips and, like, what baits to use at different times of year and how to work the baits, I guess. So, um, thank you guys for watching and, um, enjoy the video. Hey, YouTube, I'm back. So, first off, we're going to start with spinner baits. Spinner baits are an all-time great bait. All right, this is a half ounce. Um, throw these early spring to late fall. Well, just any time, really. Bass will clobber them, everything. Um, a lot of people like don't really know how to wear to tie these on if you're not acquainted to fishing. Right there, that little thingy. Um, but whatever. That was just a little thing. But these are just great. So I, on the wind blown side of a lake, pitch them into the, throw them on the wind blown side. So if the wind's coming at your face, throw them there. So um, what I'm getting to is that the bass will be piled up there because all the debris and stuff will be blown over there and bass like structure. So I'm just cast alongside the bank or straight out. And um. Yeah, that's basically the swim bait. Er, yeah, yeah, swim bait. Yeah, so um, next, we're going to talk about square bills. Square bill is a type of crankbait. Um, and it is a great bait to throw in, in a rocky lake, a lake that has lots of rocks and stuff. You can use this as a jerk. You can go boom, boom, boom in the water. You can pop it almost um or you can just reel and it'll do the action for you all right these throw all type times a year next up the chatter bait nothing about it throw it always throw it always throw it before you leave throw it doesn't matter throw it okay next up we're going to talk about the jig this is a jig as you can tell this doesn't this is it doesn't have the weedless thing or whatever. This is a half ounce. This is a quarter ounce, and this one does, because I pulled the, it off this one right here. This one has just a yum craw dad trailer. And these are great. These are bottom baits. Just go boom, boom, boom in the water. But, yes. All right, swim bait, my favorite. Yeah. Well, you might be thinking, no, this isn't. Wait, I don't know. Okay, you guys comment because I can't remember which one is the actual swim bait, the first one. But I'm here to swim bait. Just throw them. Great bait, real men. And um, they really do the work for you. This one is very realistic. This retails for about $3 more, 5 Jigs, $2. Crankbaits, 8 maybe. Swim baits like this, um, $5. Chatterbaits are really expensive. They're like eight bucks. So um, next up, deep diver, deep divers. Just throw them deep lake, rocky, and um, <clears throat> you should catch bass. I mean, there's nothing more to it. Next, this is all of our, my top water. So this is a bat. Top water should always be thrown early morning to late. Early morning and early morning and late evening is when the bass will mostly be eating these. But you can throw them all day and the bass will clobber them. But um, it's just a bat. Does the work. Those retail for like 10 bucks. So here we go. First up, you have a spook. It goes, it like, it, it walks in the water, if you know what I mean by that. It, it walks. Popper, with a little tail at the end. A bigger popper and a smaller popper but top water is one of the most exciting types of fishing because um here, here's a frog beetle us see the hooks will go down and then they're exposed Alright, 
So, um, swim aids. I didn't cover this. These should be thrown on the spawning bass, but it'll, it'll make the bass get mad, and they'll give shit of it, alright? So, um, yeah, this is just kind of a tips video. Oh, here's my text box, by the way. Wait. It came with all the boxes, about eight bucks. I don't think you guys so much for watching. If you would, please drop a like, subscribe, and comment. Please just comment. Hit the notifications, please. Hit it, please. Okay, thank you guys so much for watching. Wild Survival. And just enjoy your day. Be outside and get through this whole dumb coronavirus thing and just stay safe peace out